how to connect TikTok shop to eBay. Now, um, I'm going to uh, put this out of the way first. Uh, to really connect TikTok shop to eBay, well, if you mean connecting TikTok shop to uh, eBay and vice versa is syncing your uh, TikTok shop product with your eBay shop product. Now, mind you, your own eBay shop product, then uh, you can do that only if you are in the TikTok shop US, only if you're registered to be a seller in TikTok shop US. Now, this doesn't mean that you will have to be a resident in TikTok shop in the US, but uh, you do need a TikTok shop US seller uh, account in order for you to fully sync your product with eBay. But if you're, if what you mean by connecting TikTok shop to eBay is to uh, drop ship products from eBay to TikTok, then I will show you how to do that in this video. Okay, so for starters, now we need to uh, register your TikTok shop. And mind you, uh, before being able to add products, and sell them you need to add your warehouse information in my account and account settings and you can find it in the warehouse settings over here now uh, just make sure that you have added uh, your correct warehouse and uh, return warehouse information but uh, the workflow is like this for eBay and TikTok so you sell a product on eBay but then you need to uh, when when you got when you receive an order from TikTok, you need to uh, check out that order from eBay and send it have the product sent to your location, and then um, you can send the product ship your product to the customer who are originally buying it from TikTok. Now, why do all of this, right? Well, the reason is number one, eBay is more popular in the US, right? And it's more popular, uh, it's it's definitely more popular in the older uh, age groups, okay? And if you wanna sell products on eBay and your target market is the younger uh, population, like from 18 to 24 year olds, then being able to drop ship to TikTok shop is uh, very essential because then you will be hey, you will have access to all these uh, young generations which are more much more active on TikTok. So that's a reason why you will want to do this. Okay, so let's get started. Once you've added your warehouse information and you're able to sell products, go to products on TikTok Shop, click manage products, and let's add a new product now when you add a new product you need to uh, of course enter the details now let's just match this to the product that we want to sell from ebay now i find ebay especially useful and especially um, resourceful if you want to sell niche products like for example here i want to sell a socket an oem socket that maybe is not readily available in my country so i want to sell it and drop ship it to customers and maybe i want to play um the faster shipping rates and etc so that i can get it sent very quickly uh, which again creates value in my home market so um let's uh, copy paste the uh the uh, title over here let's copy the title and let's paste the product name and the category okay uh all right now in some cases tiktok shop uh will uh, auto add the category but sometimes it make a mistake like we see over here however most of the time i find the tiktok shop automatic category uh selection is very good so let's go to uh vehicle maybe all right there you go so we fall under the automotive so let's find automotive let's find it uh, automotive and motorcycle and go to motorcycle parts and let's see uh so these uh, we should put it to the 
cables and tubes. So let's say, all right. Okay, so let's change the category because choosing the right category is very important. And you can add your brand. Now, uh, usually in dropshipping, a brand doesn't matter because uh, while you're drop shipping, let's just um, treat it as a white label, right? However, in this specific uh, product, it is very beneficial to add the brand because uh, people who are looking to buy these type of stuff definitely uh, considers the brand for um, compatibility. So I will add Honda. So let's say I will add uh, Honda as the brand just uh, plain old plain old Honda or let's see or maybe Kawasaki uh, uh, there you go all right so once we've picked a brand you can change the uh, you can put the SNE number now this is unique to my uh, home shop uh, uh, this is basically like a serial number like the uh, national standard number now next is to uh, upload a product uh, image. Now the product image, you can easily just download the product image from the uh, uh, eBay that we just uh, that we just accessed and the project looks. Now onto the product description, let's click this and let TikTok shop uh, re, uh, type in the automatic product description so let's see this is uh, OEM replacement socket and just add our and let's generate and TikTok will generate our description there you go very nice I like TikTok because I th they feel like they're they're very high-tech and I feel like they can uh, they have a lot of tools that is very useful now I do not, I will not enable variations because it doesn't have any variations, but if you do, please uh, add them. For example, the variations can be like the colors or the sizes depending on your product. So I'll, so I'll, I'll put a, ha a healthy, a healthy markup on our product. So I'll put a 50% markup over here and the quantity is, let's say just two, because I'm not looking to sell this product too much. And I want to set a sense of scarcity. However, if you're drop shipping something that is very highly, highly readily, readily available, like from CJ drop shipping or AliExpress, just put the quantity to a thousand. That doesn't matter. So let, next, let's go to to shipping and to the weight. Let's find the weight in our website. So I think it's very important for you to match the informations of the product with the products that you're going to with the original dropship uh, the original uh, seller that you're going to drop ship dropship with um, in this case I'm just going to guesstimate it's 100 grams maybe and the delivery options will be uh, I'll just put default and okay and there you go now okay as I as you can see in my home uh, market I have the option to put this SNE certificate but I uh, will skip it for this tutorial. Okay, so the next and uh, last thing that you can do is to just click and submit for review. Now, I'm not going to click it for now because I'm not going to uh, sell this product as of currently, so I'll just save it as a draft. But the next thing that you want to do is to uh, market your product by going back to the home page and click shoppable videos and click videos from the temp and like search and make videos from the already made template that TikTok has made available for you and when you create that video you can put uh, the shop ads uh, in relation to that video so that you can actually start selling and your products is, is already listed in TikTok shop and viewed by the TikTok audience there you go that's how you drop ship products on eBay. Thank you.